Hey everybody, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to Tales of Arise. This is episode 67, and we are just continuing on with our grind of the post-game content. I think we're gonna get Dohalim's final Alfin, conversation here. Do you understand what's on the line here? What? The fish, Alfin. With all these zoogles around, nobody can give them a good home. Right. Namely, my stomach. I forgot. This is she the, uh, the... Lost fishing cavern. So if we us, beat this guy, I think the silver marlin's probably going to be here because this You've is the last like we fish spot that we have. Zoogle beat us. Not with these fish at stake. I'm pretty sure we're all in it to win it here. That's funny. Cook before resting. Yes, I do think we want to cook before resting. We're going to do. I think we're going to do a attack up medium because we have. Defense up large. Uh, if we had like an elemental defense up large, I think that would be good. Earn combat points up large. Elemental attack up large. Oh, there's elemental defense up large. That might actually be good because... Well, I say that, but the other uh, side of this is... Silver Marlin is a saltwater fish? Oh, well. I think we're just going to go with the attack up. This shall suffice. Please, everyone, have as much as you... And Dohalim. Care if I hang out for a while? Here we go. Would you perchance be interested in going on a walk together? Sure. Why? You're not on guard duty for another few hours. Which is What's why I want to walk. Oh, to hear the music in these parts. Oh, the music? We. Oui. Where are you going to find musicians all the way out here? Oh, the... There's more to music than what people play. It's in the grass fluttering in the wind. <sighs> so the much hair. The trees and the songs of birds and insects. Once you open your ears, you'll find that music is truly everywhere in this world. It is. What sounds like music depends on who's listening, huh? <laughs> it's an interesting idea, but I think it might be a little too difficult Fighting for, for me. Speaking of music, whatever happened to your instruments? You used to be a musician, didn't you? Those are well out of my reach at this point. That aside, I don't feel that I yet are have the biting? right to play any of them again. You could say that it is, in part, my way of atoning for that which I have failed to do over the years. Meaning that you haven't completely given up on making things right. Do you think me a fool stuck in the past? Spankins. Not at all. In fact, you Spankins. You sound like you're still holding out hope for a brighter future. Picture yourself being able to play your music again. Doesn't that motivate you to keep going even when things get tough? Hmm? Air concept. I see what you mean. I didn't realize that drive still lingered within me. The darkness in one's heart is sure to manifest in their music. However, I promise you that one day, when that darkness has finally lifted, I shall let you when hear me. When that darkness before. has finally well, life. Now that you said it, you're gonna have to follow through. I look forward I'm to an asshole. Play. When that darkness has finally lifted. This is why, like. My goodness, hire, like, editors once, twice, thrice, but realistically, get multiple editors, because I know from experience, when editing work, your eyes begin to glaze over, and you will miss things, and you need a second set of eyes. Next time, what say we discuss relics? Or in something like this that has so much text, a third. Once we finish eating, we should get going. All right. We are going to head on in. What do I want to do? I think for this, it's going to be maybe a little strange. I think I want to be like low on the casters and, and high on the ass beatery. Not sure, though. What? 
See how it goes. That huge Zuko over there. So this is the one who polluted the pond. Consider this payback for all those fish. Okay, this is going poorly so far. I have no idea if this is even a good strategy or not to be focusing on the little guys. I think. Like, this guy actually doesn't have all that much HP. I think the enemy is getting desperate. Got them where we want them. Don't tip your hand, though. I'm ruining the time of the power of my healing arts. Dragon form! Will this help? Sword Rain Alpha! There! Inferno Pine! Dragon form! No escape! No further! Vacuum Blade! Dragon Pine! I can't let you all down. Not today! Take this! I'm not done! Astral energy! Say no more! Okay. I'll bring you no. back from death! Shield and fight! Here's the roar! Black soul! Here I come! Dragon Eblor! Flaming Meteor! Swallow Dance! Hear me! Flame of Fury! Be still! Whoa, now! This can't be happening! Let's tear him up! Shattering Shaw! Pieces! Attack time! She did! Oh, okay. Let's see about maybe bringing in Dohalim instead. I've been hit with something. <laughs> so even a masochist has his limit. Not feeling so great. Yeah, I've seen that. It's it's a big deal. But so here's the, here's the thing is is generally speaking, the AI focuses on whatever I'm not focused on. So the AI is is wow. Basically, it, it feels like maybe it's better for me to just focus on the boss than, um, and let my allies focus on me as, I don't know, we'll see. Probably it's irrelevant, probably. Here comes a big one! 
now. I don't know what I'd do without you. Perhaps now isn't the time? I really don't. I do not have the timing on that. I, I can't I can't move I can't do anything for the full like five seconds there Dropped my ass. I could do this all day. Watch it. Here goes. Dragon Swarm. Dragon Blade. Alright, let's toss a life bottle. And we're going to toss a treat. I tried to boost him to pull him out. The life bottle. It's getting weaker. Not in your dream. Anything in order. You pick it, does it? I can carve mine. through armor. You picked the wrong fight. Vacuum blade. Tell it, hurricane. Fucking hell. Such unadulterated fury. Should have messed with me. Eat this. Ow. Ow! That sucks. my god okay that was fine <sighs> that's rough but it was fine oh well been as well <laughs> i hate you <laughs> my goodness i'm over here oh that was fine it was fine oh never mind hold up it's it's got a second version it's level 60 sweet okay cool that's Horrendous. That's absolutely horrendous. This thing's immense. On the plus side, no ads? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, 
Did Alfred just scream bloody murder? Oh shit, my bad. You picked the wrong fight. Be still. Strike. Uh, pineapple real quick. Hard pass. My goodness. Bring in um Ringwall. Here. The big one's up to something. All right then. What else it has in store. Let's smash it to pieces before it can show us. Wait, did that edit not take? Quite. Right? Ow. It's time to finish this. If a character gets hit before they swap, the swap is cancelled. Gotcha. I mean that makes sense. From Try 
Oh, it really doesn't. I should have been using fire this whole time. It's very weak to fire. Good to know. Raging current done. Yeah, the second form was quite quite a bit easier comparatively. It does it does it does like a lot of damage in a single hit, but it's just right. way more manageable. Sure. All right. Uh huh. Huh? What? Uh? Oh wow! You dummy. Wait, what the fuck is happening? Uh, good grief. Oh, we calmed down with a little bit of fishing. Good idea. Uh, I feel so gr gross and sticky after that fight. Tell me about it. We better hurry and get a bath and laundry going ASAP. Mm-hmm. That is the most important thing, right now. A fish! You saw it too? Hey, a fish! Excite! Great! Yes. <laughs> it's fish time. Very excite much wow. Zappy doppelganger. All right. My body is ready. What do we have here? You're still not done fishing yet? We have Fogwarl Pikes and Signi Pirarusu. Fogwarl Pike. Well, there's the Zappy Doppelganger works for that. And the Porty Mudslinger works for this. So AY to start. I hope we catch something decent. Indeed. Hungry bellies are counting on this. <laughs> All right. Okay, here we go. All right, this one's relatively easy. Okie dokie. That's not a fish I see often. So what's it to be? Grilled or broiled? All right, and here we go. Hmm? This feels like a big one. Uh oh. Okay. Come on, buddy. Give me something better. There we go. There we go. Mm-hmm. Nice. Easy. Easy. Wow. This fish is seriously Holy rare. shit. Oh, my gosh. That's a really rare species. A Big ass fish. There's only one more boss fish left. Yeah. Indeed. What kind of fish is that? It's such a pure white. 
Yeah, it's beautiful. It reminds Hola. me of Poodle's wings. Hey, how's it going, Tiff? Thanks for the Hola. bits. What are you up to tonight? Judging from the color of the scales, I'd say it's a Cygni Piraruku. They say it swims so Piraruku. elegantly that it's like a bird flying underwater. Wow, that must be beautiful. I'd love to see it for myself. That may be a tall order. The Piraruku doesn't like to show its face very often. Speaking of which, what exactly is Hoodle doing over there? Just got done streaming hmm? Seven Days to Die. Ooh, how do you do? How do you um? How'd you like that? You started Hoodle, yesterday. What do you think you're doing? Um, the do my my group like did like a Seven Days to no Die idea. run. I think about a year ago at this point. The point. Um, and they seem to no really enjoy it. I didn't, unfortunately, I didn't so have many. time to really get into it. Maybe it's all a um, but plan. it seemed neat. He thinks if he brings enough fish, he can trade them. It definitely seems like it's up your alley. Got you himself. through your first horde Seriously? run today? <laughs> Hell yeah. Are you playing with anybody else or are you playing solo? <laughs> it's okay, Hoodle. It's a big fish. There's plenty for you to eat too, okay? Aww. You heard her, Hoodle. Lucky you. But since he went out of his way to catch so many fish, might as well cook those up too. Hey, it's that ingredient. Until Jay got his helicopter yeah, stuck in the trees. The Look. You always have an eye for food. <laughs> I remember there being complaints about that. Oh my goodness. That's funny. Um before we before we uh teleport out of here, I am going to Grab these crystals just in case they've got some level 5 materials or something. It was stuck midair, excuse me. Oh, we got level 4s. Eef. Eef. Odie boy. Odie baboyo. Ooh, hey, there's some 5s. Transcended pebbles. here. Ah, fish. A salmon. <gasps> oh, the boy. Chief says you deserve pets. I don't think so. Ganja and Queenie are gonna play with you. Nice. <gasps> oh, yes, sir. There's a big yawn. There's a big yawn. Hey, stop that. That's my, that's my controller. Boyo. Why are we going to this one? Found the best way to get some resources to harvest cars. Gotcha. Also, how's it going, Jake? How are you doing tonight? Lurka lurkin. Uh, oh, it's this guy up here on the um, the hey, cliff gave us cute. the quest about Quick gawking and let's uh, go. the Ow. secret fishing cave to begin with. You need a wrench? Okay. Okay. Hell yeah. Good one. Boy, every time I move the camera, you decide you uh. need to move. Good, good. All right. <laughs> good grief. Burning blood. Hey! Trying to get your workbench so you can make ammo. Yeah. Increased art casting resilience. Tidal wave. Oh, because she was going to cast tidal wave. Nice. Okay, well, we'll start learning that. Over limit extension. Cool. Really helpful with other people and plan. We have truly plan out ahead of time what to put striking them. example of yeah, that's female fair. determination this day. Yeah. Because there's These actually days. a lot to do in that game as far as like learning stuff goes. Okay, so Um, next location, I think, is actually going to be the 
Ooh, I wonder if that book is the final book that we need for Adelina Palace. I don't know if the the that book is something or if it's let's check. What was that? We got Burning Blood. A legendary tome once owned by a relic loving witch. Apparently it shows its true value when combined with its accompanying slip cover. Burning Blood. Not as good. Did pretty good on your building. Built house on top of a bridge. They attacked the bridge supports trying to get to you. Wow. You're on the lake and the bird on top of the tower. Yeah, the bird on top of the tower, I think, is the hardest of what we've seen. Um. Oh, the boy. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in that game for you to do. Huh? That can't be. I guess. Hm. Great. Elder cloak. Why? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Dummy. Whoa. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, Catchy. Pancake recipe. You don't think the bird is super hard? I mean, it's kind of like if free in the sense that you don't really fight it. Ah. You just fight the other stuff constantly. There. Um. I was thinking of looking for something specifically, but I do not remember what I was thinking of looking for. Uh, whatever. Elder Cloak. Unfortunately, all of these things, because we've been to the final dungeon, so I feel like, you know, we were supposed to maybe get some of the hey, stuff prior. A little red there. But it's whatever. You working up a we're just, uh, we're just completing things. Vincent! What is this? We need to rest oh. anyways, so. You dummy! What did I do? Do Halim pancakes! Huh? Huh? What? Do Halim. Oh, I was gonna look. That's what I was gonna look at. I was gonna look at, um. Pancakes. Unkick? Ooh! Or up large. Double ingredients. Or plus 90% to cooking. Boost the duration. I'd rather consume double ingredients. I don't know why I'm doing this right now, but whatever. Maybe I'll go do some, like, ore farming here in a little bit. Okay. <laughs> New random quest. Who dis? Let's see what's up. Filled with equal parts compassion and passion, always ready to boldly rescue anyone from the perils of the munchies. Okay. Delectable, ineffable Dohalim pancakes. Get them while they're hot. That's quite the sales pitch. This is all new to me as well, I assure you. Why, if it isn't Lord Dohalim himself? Care for a pancake, my uh, lord? Very surprising. Might as well have some while we're here. Indeed. However, <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about eating my own visage in front of the populace. Are they made in the shape of his face? At least let me show you how to make them. That's a little creepy. I'll also teach you the most important part. Oh, this sounds like pure gold. I'm game. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> right? Hey! We should make some pancakes right now. I just did. They were drawing Dohalim's face back there. That seems like a handy trick to keep in your back pocket. It does. The recipe's light on ingredients, and a little extra work could bring the flavor right out. Great. Then let's make some together. Our very own personalized pancakes. Sure. I got this. You're out, Alfin. 
I don't need spicy pancakes. Hey, a little bit of spice never hurt a pancake. You're out too, Kisara. You'd win easily. What? Wow. You know what? Is it a competition? Yes. Yes. A contest between me, Xi'an, and Dohalim. Why'd she leave Law out? Wait, what? I'm more of an eating specialist. You can say that again. <laughs> Oof. I accept any and all challenges. There are some Tonys in there, yes. right? Then I'll be the judge. I'd be down with that. I can gather the ingredients. Okay. Then it's on. Hey, what about me? Seriously, Law just got fully left out. That's so rude. Anna's tastiest pancake. Maybe we'll have some luck finding what we need at the farm. What the fuck? What has happened? What is this random ass quest that we're now on? Oh, whatever. Post game shit. Let's do it. We've reached our destination. Get out of here. Better not come back. Rat. Got it. <laughs> right. Thanks. Oh. Add meringue. It makes the dough nice and fluffy. Whoa. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to find out once and for all whose pancakes reign supreme. Wow. I guess he's emceeing now. Let's hear some thoughts from Kisara, our judge. Indeed. This is a highly eclectic group of competitors. <laughs> what is I happening? I look forward to seeing what they produce for us today. Expectations sure are running high. Ah, and here comes Xion with her entry. I applied all of my know-how to this and put extra care into the visual presentation. Well, that's bold. Nothing wrong with Xion holding her head high. Let's see how it tastes. <laughs> what? I mixed in some candy that tingles the tongue. Oh, um, I see. It's creative. I'll oh, no. That. But it's quite, uh, a mouthful, as it were. It, it might be too sweet. Well, I should hope so. I put in as much food and sugar as I could. It should provide three days worth of nourishment. Three days? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, three days worth? Our judge has been left stunned. And not in a good way. Goodness gracious. Now it's time for the Lord himself. Here is what I made. What, what the? Dohalim pancakes. I can't believe he actually did the art. Well, I mean, <laughs> this Go is on. what started Relish this all. Crowning achievement to your that, seems, that seems perfectly valid to well, me, Dohalim. don't mind if I do. <laughs> Oh, what? Not even a moment's pause. What the fuck Don't is inside me. that? There's some strange liquid leaking out of this. Indeed. I gather delicacies the world over and pack them all in. That's what makes my masterpiece so good. Pancakes are overrated anyway. Oh, no! And you're out. And, you're out. <laughs> and wow. just like that, his <laughs> lordship is disqualified. What? Ah, uh, well, what do I do? Renwell I, wins just because she made regular, regular pancakes. pancakes. Because Xion can't cook, and Dohalim is so... over extravagant. How am I supposed to follow Derex? Renwell, you're up. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Just putting on some finishing touches. And who's oh, gonna be like, no, little... don't do anything. It's fine. You oh, got this. Oh your shit. Face. What the fuck happened to Hoodle? Are you sure? <laughs> well, okay. All right, if it's not broke, like, don't fix it, right? Sit, I actually, don't, don't get me wrong, right? You can combine a bunch of really expensive ingredients and create something uh, amazing. But simple uh, food is still tasty. It's good okay. for a reason. Made it. Here you go. Nice. Oh, no. You didn't. Uh, never mind. Let's see what Judge Kisara thinks. Hmm. 
Let's see. It's nice and soft around the edges, and yet there's a hoodle face firmly imprinted in the middle. Ruh -roh. The contrast of fluffiness and firmness is simply fascinating. And there's a sweet texture that's nicely offset by the jam's tartness. The jam's that, tart? Why is the jam the tart? I'm used to jam being sweet, not gives tart. Me this odd sense of ardor and conviction. I give this a perfect <laughs> winning score. This is... <laughs> This is such Good a random well, quest, but double. it is a fun random quest. Looks I will like give you that. You supreme over pancake dough. Yeah, it's significantly, <sighs> it's a significantly better I random quest than what was that perfect. one quest that we did, oh, Jay? I have done wrong? In, huh? Where's Kisara? Was it in, in Symphonia? She took off running or was it in Eternia? That was just like, no, I, I don't think it was either of them. I guess I was only thinking it was about some what I personally would want to really eat. weird random well, quest. You know, I don't remember what game it was in though. Good. I could go for more of this texture and salty sweetness. I agree. Still, they pale next to Rinwell's pancakes. Yeah, no question there. In fact, I would love to partake in them again sometime. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Whatever gave it such a fright? Uh, d don't worry about it. I'll draw all of your faces next time. I can't wait. You just draw them, right? Eternia had a, a cooking game with minigame. No, 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 it wasn't that. I'm, I'm thinking there was a, there was a, there was some quest. We were, we were like doing all of these weird quests in one of the RPGs. What RPGs did we do recently? Where's, where's our? I say recent. Our um, where's our completed guide? Let me look at this and see if I can um, rock a memory here. I. It was, uh, I put it out of my mind. It was Legend of Mana. That's what it was. It Remember when we did the the quest where she was, it was like the daughter, but she was like a, a doppelganger, slime, sentient creature thing. It was just super duper weird, right? I was thinking of like, oh, this is weird, but it's not that weird right this is weird and cutesy and fun that was just fucking weird it was just really strange and it made no sense and yeah needed to go to space and there was like telepathy to the dad and at first we thought that they hated the dad and they wanted to assassinate the dad it was what, what is happening it was it was yeah, slime monster alien doppelganger. I don't. It was the weirdest thing in existence, and it has uh, carved a niche into my my brain. Moving on. Right, pass. Hard pass. Okay, what else we got? We we need to defeat all the lights. Faster AG recovery is probably going to be good. We'll go with increased crit damage. This is probably going to be a good tree for us to just. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I think. Probably deer time. Let's go kick a deer in the face. Well, we'll try to kick a deer in the face, anyways. We've reached our destination. I got cat hair all over my freaking face. Fucking me up. <laughs> Ugh. Excuse me. Gotta blow my nose. Okay. Let's swap. Aww. 
Thank you. Yeah, I got really, um... I don't know, I got a really bad head cold yesterday. I was really, 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 like, sick and <sighs> snot and okay. everything. It was just crazy. Oh, yeah, I, I have to, I, like, huh, like full-on <laughs> everything out of here. But, um, I was really bad last night, but today has been mostly okay. I'm, I, as you can see, I'm a little sneezy here or there, but for the most part, I'm, I'm all right. Okay, we've seen this, like, twice. Two or three times. Sound like a goose? Yeah. I'm a I'm a honker. Okay. This guy. What are you muttering about? Focus or you'll get hurt. Don't worry. I'll have this wrapped up in a flash. Super Slam will run save you. Aim for the weak spot. Tell him charge like that can easily be faithful. Just as well, I'm here to stop. Get it to hear it now. You're mine. No escape. Bro, it's actively trying to like. Here we go. Did we core break it already? What did I tell you? Don't get in our way. No, we didn't core break it. Watch out. It's changing its attack. Oh, hell. Stay away from my friend. Dragon Swarm. That's a Scarlet Inferno. I didn't get it. Scarlet Inferno! The picture of hell. Oh shit. Took my hand off my controller because I thought I was safe and out of uh That's not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hold the fucking phone, my man. Holy shit, this guy is just popping shit out everywhere. Holy crap. Or are those ears? Oh no. See, like, she literally, I, I summoned her on to, Kassara's, Kassara's things need, needs a, a change, it needs a buff. Trying to learn my lesson to not just walk into the fucking thing. I keep getting boosts on it, but I don't know how. I walked back into that. 
trying to get back into the heel circle and I walked into its freaking water ball assault. Hard pass, my man. Alright, Incineration Wave does a lot of damage to it. That slaps! Holy crap! Stay the fuck away from that. Now I'm real mad. I'll crush you. The sky. All of these things are kind of like all over the place. CP up. I didn't know. I. I'm okay. I think its bar is not set correctly because I keep getting the breaks at the quarters, but just before the quarters. Ooh, core break. I think you're getting them every time you knock him out of his current element. Yeah, but I would assume I'm... He, he's had four elements. I'm assuming that they would be tied to... But maybe not. Who knows? I assume that they would be tied to his health. But maybe they're just not. I don't know. Oh my god, he one shot me and Law. At basically the same time. Oh, 
to stop you dying? Oh, right. Now we're never. All good things come to an end. Sorry. Ooh. Okay, that was um, that was fine. Night Blossom. Interesting. What was with that creature? That was a fun fight. I enjoyed the multiple forms, the different changes. I wish more enemies had that type of stuff. Different forms, different phases, different attack patterns. What makes you so sure? Because... What the... Whoa! What the hell is that? Is the enemy back for more? Whatever it is, it's freaking huge! You guys, calm down. It's okay. It's probably... No, it's definitely the Phantom Flower of Navira. The Northern Lights? Love when games just co-op nor Northern Lights. It was described as a mysterious light floating up in the sky. It's not dangerous at all. In fact, this is the place it was first discovered. So that's how it got its name then. Are you sure it's not some enemy astral art being cast at us? I mean, if it was, you're basically fucked. What are you gonna do? Unusual weather phenomenon more than anything else. Cislodia obviously used to be covered in darkness around the clock, but with that gone, I guess that's why we're able to see this again. You could be right. It's so pretty, though, isn't it? Sure, but it's so big we could have seen it from town just fine, couldn't we? Well, sure, but still. Hey, who cares where we saw it? I'm just glad we got to see it at all. Sure. Besides, that Zoogle was what kept us from seeing it before, right? Yeah, I guess so. Yay! It's such a gorgeous night sky here. Have a good night, Tiff. Thanks you for dropping really by. Have, have a good one. Watch it. Right. Right. I'll, uh, do that. It took a lot to get here, but I can't help but feel like a dream of mine came true. Thanks, Law. I didn't do all that much, really. Well, I still really appreciate it. It made me really, really happy. Uh, oh. Hey, uh, you know, I... Oh, it looks like you can see it even better from over there. I'm gonna go check it out. Huh? Hey, wait! Red well... Or law. <sighs> Those two are doomed, by the way. That's never gonna work. The Phantom Flower of Navira. The Glut Glutton's Guidebook? This what? History. Old text on food and a thorough one at that. Though it mainly deals with fruits, there are some entries pertaining to bells and tea. I... I think I'm getting stronger. Think. All right. Let's take a look at stuff real quick. Nice. Try to finish that up. Tidal Wave! I'm actually really excited to see that. Another artifact? Gotcha. Well, we will check that in just a momento. Increase max AG. Okay, so, artifact, Glutton's Guidebook. Oh, yeah, we have the maze, the code. 
Oh, it's Pac-Man. Pac-Man is the glutton. That's funny. Cooking effect boost one, cooking effect book boost two, and cooking effect boost three. Makes the effect of recipes last 80% longer. Goes from 10% to 20% to 80% longer. That's kind of badass. Very cool. All right, that's going to be the end of this video. If you're watching on Twitch, stick around. We're going to keep playing. If you're watching on YouTube, hope you enjoyed, and we will see you next time for more Tales of Arise. Bye-bye, everybody. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the distant horizon.